continue our leaf peeping series with a trip All to the right. fifth highest peak in New York State, yeah. where you can take in those fiery colors of peak fall foliage. It's pretty nice up there. Cassie oh, Hudson yeah. took a trip and she takes off of that story this morning. Cassie. Hey Hi. there. This morning we're taking you on an adventure in the clouds. The 20 minute experience will leave you in awe of the beauty of the Adirondacks. And while your friends, they're going to be jealous of all your pictures. Just take a look. Right now it is at its absolute peak. Located in Wilmington, Whiteface Mountain is one of the highest peaks of the Adirondack Mountains and the fifth highest peak in New York State. Depending on how adventurous you are, there are a couple different ways to soak up the views from the top. In the fall, we have amazing activities. Veterans Memorial Highway, where you drive up to the summit of Whiteface Mountain. You can either hike up the last 276 feet or go through a 400 foot tunnel to the middle of the mountain and take a 27 story elevator ride to the very, very top. If you're not afraid of heights, take a ride on the Cloud Splitter Gondola. <laughs> it's like a bird's eye view in flight, transporting visitors from the base of Whiteface Mountain to the peak of Little Whiteface. A little bit of a bumpy ride, but I'm okay. <laughs> The easiest way to do the gondola if you're a little bit afraid of heights is to face downhill both ways. It's a little insider tip. The 15 to 20 minute ride immerses you in the vibrant colors of nature. The fall foliage is just spectacular right now. You couldn't ask for a better year for colors. I've really never seen it this vibrant. At the peak itself, you can step off the gondola to look around and find yourself surrounded by Lake Placid and its surrounding beauty. There's a beautiful deck looking over Lake Placid Lake and the high peaks region of the Adirondack Park. You can actually see the ski jumps and Mount Van Hovenberg. Worth the view. And then if you walk over to the other side, you can see Lake Champlain and into the Green Mountains as well. If you want to check it out, this is your last weekend to experience it during its peak fall foliage. That operation does close on Monday to prepare for its winter ski operation. Now there are so many ways that you can experience not only this attraction, but so many others there in the area. It's called the Lake Placid Legacy Sites Passport Program. For all the details, just visit that website, news10.com. Incredible. What a great assignment, Cassie. Thank you.